Hi everybody and welcome to my video on temperature. This is a fairly short video and a relatively straightforward subject, but it is just as important as the more complicated ones, particularly because it's quite common in exams. I hope you find it useful. So it's worth starting by saying that everything has a temperature and quite simply the temperature of something tells us how hot or cold it is. Now when you hear people talking about temperature you hear the word degrees. So temperature is measured in degrees. There are in fact uh, one or two different types of units that we use but normally when we are talking degrees we mean degrees Celsius. And here at the bottom is how we write it. The symbol degrees is a little zero, which we put after the number, and C for Celsius. So, for instance, if something is 12 degrees, it would be 12 degrees Celsius. 12 degrees C. Now, here are some common temperatures, just to give us an idea of how the degrees Celsius works. So, for instance, an oven when it's cooking is usually up to around 230 degrees Celsius whereas your fridge is probably around 4 5 degrees a room temperature just to be comfortable is around about 18 degrees whereas a hot sunny day in Britain might be around 27 degrees if you have water boiling in a pan then if it's boiling away it's at 100 degrees and it freezes at 0 degrees and in fact this is the sort of information that you might get asked about in exam questions for instance they may say that yesterday we had a temperature nice hot sunny day it was 27 degrees whereas today it is cooler and it's only 19 degrees the question might be what is the difference in temperatures between the two days in fact this is fairly straightforward to, because to find the difference between two temperatures you would simply take the lowest temperature away from the highest and get eight degrees and don't forget when you are answering questions which have units like degrees celsius you must always put the units on your answer it is also quite common to be given information about temperatures in a table such as the one we have here and you may be asked questions about the information that it gives for instance it may ask which city has the highest temperature of course the highest number is the highest temperature so in this case you would give the answer of Dubai with 38 degrees Celsius or what is the difference in temperature between Madrid and Stockholm again you have to find the two temperatures here we have Madrid here we have Stockholm and difference between is 27 minus 4 equals 23 degrees Celsius and at the moment that's all we have on that topic as I said fairly straightforward Hope you enjoyed it. Please, if you did, hit the subscribe button on my channel. Thank you.